Hello everybody, this is Orange, and uh, looks like we're in a uh, padded cell here or something. So, welcome to Breakout. This is a new series we're going to be starting here. It is not a new mod pack. It's a mod pack, but it's not new. Uh, and uh, basically the premise is you have to break out of this uh, little area here. It gets bigger. Uh, you'll see as we go along. I'll leave a link to the pack in the description if I remember. Alright, so let's get started with our quest book here. We have quests. In this pack, imprisoned. Ah, Minecraft. Worlds to explore, monsters to fight, castles to build. But wait, where am I? This isn't Minecraft. This is just some sort of horrible padded cell. Am I going mad or just fighting mad? Let me out. Let me out. All right, that's our first quest complete. Super easy. Let's see our next question. Wool gathering. Well, at least this prison is only made out of wool. Easy enough to break out. Uh, all right. So it looks like we can get string for. Now, I, I have to add, I have played. Uh, we get a lot of strings in that. Um, well, we got one rice bread. I have played a little bit of this pack before. Uh, not too much. I played it like a couple times, but not not far at all. So, a lot of this is going to be new to me. So, But I, the basic idea is not new to me. So, here we go. String. Curious. When I try to grab the wool my, with my bare hands, they come up with only fluff and string. If I hold, hold something in my hand, I'm able to break it in a block of wool instead. I see that. All right. Oh, some some wood behind there. All right, that should be our quest complete. Quest complete. Now we need four of them. All right. Oops, I, I just I have to exit out of the world. I'll be back when I get back in the world. Okay, I've gathered the right amount of wool. We've got our quest complete. And there we go. Got four torches now for our reward. Now the shipping crate. Well, so much for an easy escape. Am I inside some sort of shipping crate? Am I being sent across the wide ocean and will soon get rescued by pirates who will name their king and give me all their booty? Well, probably not so much back to the project. Probably not. Probably well, probably not. So back to the project at hand. Time to punch a tree, right? Yep. And I know what's gonna happen if I do this, but you don't. Ow! Punching wood hurts. So I guess we have to use our fists. No. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Hmm, ouch. The rules certainly have changed, although it's no, not a surprise that punching a tree isn't a good idea. But I have no tools at all. What if I focus on the planks instead of the logs and try to just tap at them until I find a hollow spot? Oh. I guess. Oh, I guess if we punch them, they just get. Alright. Yeah, okay, that, that's cool. We have two large medical bandages. Great. Oh, I shouldn't have put... Yeah, there we go. Got a bunch of medical bandages. A, a medical... Large medical bandage. Well, my nails are broken, but at least I have a few sticks I can see past a shipping crate. I don't think beating stone with my bare hands will accomplish anything. What if I use one of these sticks? All right. What did I just get hit with? I guess this, this is what you're supposed to do with this. Wait, are you supposed to punch this? What are you... That's not doing anything. Uh, what? Is this giving me anything? Oh, it gives us flint, I see. Yeah. Oh, being the stone. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so we've got flint. It's going to give us some carrot juice. Sweet success. Uh, we need to make a flint axe. We don't have that mod. It doesn't, you can't get J.I. from the quest book. Just like this. All right, simple, simple, super simple. Flint axe. There we go. Ta-da. Toast. Get some toasts. Um, alright, let's get our next quest done. Oh, let's make a crafting table. A crafting table at last. I feel so much better. I do too. I mean, it's just, it's not even, yeah. Now, there's a very limited amount of wood here, so we gotta be careful with what we do with it. There's our, oopsies. Alright, we got our crafting table now. There we go. Alright, at last. I'm to get to the chest too. Oh, uh, let's make a crafting table, crafting station. Great, fantastic. That's a good idea. Make a crafting station out of it. I'm actually gonna put this down here because um, we're gonna have to need a bunch of space later, I think. And there's very limited space, so we want to conserve on space as much as we possibly can. Ice, ice, baby. I have made an exciting discovery, water in the walls. I think I'll use some of this wood and string to try to filter some of the sediment. If I set up my strainer so that flowing water can move through a mesh portion up top, it will work best. So in a strainer base and survival strainer, first I want to find the water in the walls. So, um, I think it's here. 
Yeah, there it is. All right. Now, all right. Good. So we need a survive. What is it? A oops. A, survivor, a strainer base and a survivalist strainer. So a strainer base. A strainer base is crafted like this. Oops. I think. Uh ah. Okay. So we need a. Oh, we need our chest back. So they give us a chest, I guess. Um, we need some more wood for our trap door. And that should be pretty easy. And now this is, the strainers in this pack are how we get our materials. So, get our trap doors, make our strainer base. And now we just need a survivalist, survivalist strainer. Which is here, we just need a net, a net. Easy to, this is super cheap. Um, and we need some more sticks. We're out of wood again. Fantastic. All right. All right. That should be enough. There we go. Got our survivalist strainer. Now, I guess what we have to do is break the lava. The lava? Did I just call this lava? Oh, whoops, 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 whoops. Made a mistake. Is that how we're supposed to do it? I don't know. I'm not sure how this is supposed to work. I don't remember how I did it last time. We're getting some stuff already from that. Let's make like a... Uh... Oh, I know what we can do. We can put our trap door. There we go. Now it'll work. So we can see the strainer. And we can even walk under this for some reason. All right, good. We're we're moving. We're, oh, we got some slabs too. That's that's what we should use as our slabs that they give us with the quest reward. Of course. All right. Now we don't know what We can't crouch underneath that. That's fine. Whatever. We need a stone pebble, eight stone pebbles, and one clay. Okay, and it says I can even set up multiple streams off of a single source so they do lose efficiency. So, uh, oh, this is a, oh, this is a, like if we, a reset if we need, if we messed up. So we're just going to get eight stone pebbles and one clay out of the strainer. Yeah, one clay, you just need eight stone pebbles. Now, uh, I think you can do this, to, oops. With stone pebbles, as you can craft them, you get them out of strainers, and you can craft them into cobblestone with clay. So that's what it wants us to do: is make cobblestone that way. Later on, we're gonna be able to get a hammer, which we can uh, hammer the the cobble the, the, the stone in the walls and get pebbles that way, if I recall correctly. So I'm just gonna wait for us to get this, and uh, we're getting there already. We got two. That's andesite. We need we need a bait pot. Yeah, we need a bait pot. Bait pot. Bait pot slot. <laughs> All right. So I'm just gonna wait. There's another uh, more pebbles. So I'm just gonna hold on here. Wait a second. AFK, and then I'll wait for us to get the necessary stuff. I'll be right back. All right. Our last two pebbles. There we go. Press complete, and we get a strainer base and efficiency meter. All right. Is our first strainer, I think. Alright, so now we should be able to make the cobblestone. Probably wants to, what it wants to do. I don't want to waste this though, but that should be fine. Cobblestone. And I got Stone Age. Cobblestone wants us to, to get two cobblestone, which is more work, more grind for me, but whatever. Let's see what our other quests are. Emergency fuel. Since I seem to have a pretty limited amount of fuel, perhaps I can better use some of these twigs from my strainer as fuel. Individually, they don't burn long enough for me to do any good, but if I bundle them up tightly, they do the job. Alright, so bundle of sticks and content tweaker. So they must have made that up. Alright, there we go. It's just nine sticks. It's super easy. I, mean, I am just going to use this. Uh. Use the wood we found on the walls. I assume we'll get more sticks eventually. All right, bundle of sticks. There we go. That's our quest complete. We got charcoal for that. Cool. And we're just waiting on some more um, pebbles to show. We already got two. I'm gonna AFK again, and I'm gonna wait for us to get enough pebbles to make a second piece of cobblestone that it wants for our quest. 
So I'll be right back. All right, got our final two pebbles, and we're gonna try to finish the quest now. Make our other piece of cobblestone. All right, my game is lagging usually for some reason here for a second. All right, well, clay seems to be not that rare, but these. All right, there we go. Got our two cobblestone, so we can make do our quests. All right, and um. Stone hammer, alright, so that should not be too hard. That's just like this. And there we go, and we got a BAM's pineapple pizza from one mod from Tiny Progressions. Alright. Alright. So we got either Furnace, Bait Pot, Fisherman's Strainer, or Cooked Fish. Wants us to craft this stuff. Uh, a furnace should not be too hard, so we're going to do that right now. And hopefully you're enjoying these this, this, these videos too. Uh, I don't know if you're enjoying them. So if you do enjoy them, please uh, leave a comment and let me know what you think. We need a bait pot, which is... What is a bait pot? So we just need a flower pot and a trap door there for that one. So that's just three clay. We just need another clay. Probably we've already got another clay. Nope, we didn't get another clay. But that's, that's not... Uh, expensive. I mean, it's, it's the trap doors are kind of expensive. Fisherman's trainer um, is you know, we need a bunch of sugar canes. We can use the dried up sugar canes. We just need four more of those. Uh, now we should have gotten another quest, but now I think we have this one moving day. As I claim precious inches of space, I end up moving my chests around a lot. Instead of breaking them, I can shift right click them with an empty hand. And as long as I'm close enough, I can pick them up and move them with easy. Move them with easy. Yeah, move them with easy. That's exactly, that's grammatically correct. Move them with easy. Work with all everything with an inventory. Alright. I'm gonna get two survival sooner for that. For not doing nothing. Isn't that funny? Alright, I'm gonna go clean some of this stuff up and I'm gonna make more space in this place and uh, I'll be right back. I'm gonna enjoy some carrot juice. Yum yum, right? Alright. Uh, let's see if we got, okay, yeah, we can get some of this melting up. And you can even probably make tiny charcoal. Oops, bye-bye charcoal. Okay, here it is. Um, make tiny charcoal there. And if you don't know what tiny charcoal is, you probably do, but it just is melt one item. All right, so I did clean some of the space out. Uh, uh, so we're going to wait for this to cook up. And, oh yeah, I think, where's our chest? I don't know what, we can't pick this up, can we? Oh, we can't pick this up, great, amazing. I'm not sure, if, I don't want to, I don't want to risk picking this up while it's melting. Uh, it's not the end of the world if you lose this stuff, but you never know, that happens frequently. Alright, so, uh, oh, we can make a sieve now. I want us to make a sieve, a sieve, a sieve, a sieve, and a flint stiff and mesh. Alright, so how do I make a sieve? I don't a sieve. I can't think of how I was saying sieve. What can I say? Yeah, okay. So I think a sieve is just like this. Oops. Nope. That's a heavy one. Oh, it's a log. Okay. That's pretty expensive, actually. And then a flint to mesh. Um... Uh, you know, string mesh, which we can do. We have infinite string. And then we can just do this. Flint is not hard to come by. We can just hit the, the stick. Hit the, the here with, like, watch. Let's let's demonstrate. We've already demonstrated the power and demonstrate again. All right, there we go. We got some more flint. See, so just look at that. All right, now I think, um, let's see this toast. Yummy. All right. All right, we can do that, and we can, after combining these stone holes in the gravel, I can use a mesh similar to what I'm using in the strainer to sieve out, sieve out some useful bits. Now I want the extra part, gravel, 16 gravel is what it wants. So that makes gravel, right? That makes four gravel. So we just have to wait for more more pebbles to come in. But right now I think we can work on the other on this other quest. Oh, let's pick this up now that we can. There we go. Put it over there. Uh, so we need a, ch a trap door. For some reason, we're a chest, but there we go. Trap door. Put on our sieve over here or something. And put our mesh in it. And.
then now let's, we should be able to do this. We have to make a pot first. There we go. Pot and oh, we already had a trapdoor. Okay, that's a bait pot. Now what else do we need for this quest? We need uh, a fisherman's strainer, which we need more of the the um, more of these, which we just get from straining, right? Uh, and then we can and the zite. So it's gonna take a little while, so I'm just gonna sit around and wait. Uh, I don't want to see any of this gravel in case it um, doesn't recognize it. Yes, yeah, it's an up to date thing, but. Uh, oh, let's check the other quest lines that opened up. So we can make an oak crucible. By the still leaves down, by placing them in a wood crucible, I should be able to recover some of the water. That makes perfect sense. The friend leaves and water comes out. Very scientific, right? <laughs> Alright, I'll make a cheap tin bucket move with. Okay, yeah, so we can't make an in infinite water source. And we can make barrels. Why did I say it like that? Uh, okay, so uh, we need to get leaves somehow, though. That is, we can't get that. Yet. Oh, we can. We can't make a chest. We get three chests. All right. So that's a free quest. Um, let's put. It, I'm gonna put some of my junk in here and stuff I don't need it anymore. I'll just uh, clean this up, and I'll be right back. All right. So we have enough for that for the uh, the fisherman thing. What's it called? F fisherman. Fisherman's uh, strainer. So, oh, we need more string, which we can get easy. Oh, I'm not, I need to have an empty hand. All right, there we go. So now I can make the net and the fisherman's strainer. And if you put this in the strainer base. Oops, wrong. Oops, oh, whoops, he's. Uh, let's make another axe. Because we don't want to punch that. Alright, let's get a stick to get some flint. There we go. There we go. Alright. Um, these these flint axes go away real fast. Like they don't have any, they have barely any durability. Now, I, we are going to, by doing this, we are going to make the durability go down a little bit. Uh, oh, I had some slabs. We, I mean, not the durability, the efficiency go down a little bit, so this can be less efficient. We do need some worms and the bait pots for this one, or a bait pot, a bait pot. Where do I put the bait pot? Do I put the bait pot in here. Bait pot doesn't even sound like a word anymore. Bait pot, bait pot, bait pot. Say, try saying that five times fast. Bait pot, bait pot, bait pot. We got. How do we get that in there? That doesn't. No, that must be really rare, unless or unless it like fell in there or something. And there is, seems to be. All right, we're gradually making more progress on our gravel. We need sixteen of them. Um. And trashy garbage bin, uh, garbage bin. Uh, oh, I think you know what we can do. <laughs> we don't have to be. We actually don't have to be waiting for the strainer. We can just hammer the walls. I'm kind of dumb. Oh, we, and here's andesite, and we cannot break this down. We need a pick for that. I think, from what I can tell. And we look at that. We already have all kinds of. Uh, we made 19. All right. All right, so now we got our quest complete. I am a officially dumb, a dumb orange. All right, uh, quest complete. And all right, I'm gonna go sieve, sieve this gravel. And uh, um, oh, you know what we should make? Um, oh yeah, I, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna sieve this for a little while and be right back. All right, yeah, let's look at like another quest. I got a quest opened up. So sieving for freedom. I only sieved like three pieces of gravel and we got this. So we need iron ore chunks. We do this automatically. We need the iron ore chunks, which are these combined together. So, and then the other thing we need is coal, which is, I think we're getting tiny coal from this. So, and so that is going to do that. And then for this, we get another sieve and another flint stiff and mesh. So we can set these up next to each other and make it be more efficient. So I'm going. So I'm going to continue to sieve, sieve. <laughs> I have to get out of the habit of saying it the wrong way, and I'll be right back when that's done. All right. So. All right. So looks like we can uh, finish up our quest now. We can make our coal and our 
iron pieces. I didn't even finish uh, sifting all this. Sieving or sieving? Sieving. Is it sifting or sieving? Yeah, okay, here we go. We got our, our other, oops, our other flint, our other sieve. And uh, this is, I'm not going to be able to pronounce this right. Our other sieve and our, our other mesh. So I'm going to go sieve the rest, oops, I'm going to sieve the rest of this gravel. I'll be right back. So much quicker and so much more bearable when, you, when you're doing it twice as fast. And sieving is about my least favorite thing about ex nihilo or ex nihilo or ex nihilo, however you say it. Uh, Alright, better strength, survival strength, or dense. So now I have access to better materials, I can, bet I can make an improved mesh for my old water strainer. So survival strainer, dense. Survival strainer, dense, which is, oh, ho, ho, ho. You need iron ingots for that, so, or iron nuggets, which are made out of iron ingots. Let's how we get sand. Okay, we can hammer the gravel down to, hammer the gravel, hammer the gravel down to sand, and uh, make, uh, um, uh, those things, and, oops, I should not be doing that. I'm gonna, can I get some more gravel, and just hammer it down, I'm gonna sift the sand, and I'll be right back. All right, I'm not actually going. I'm not actually gone. I'm still here. You haven't missed anything. Um, we're just gonna. Oops, that was weird. Um, so I wonder if you have vein miner. I don't think so. Like, why would we have vein miner? Yeah, you don't have vein miner. But whatever. We're gonna, ha we're gonna hammer this gravel down to sand, and I will sift these up. You can't sift these. What? Not sift sand. Can't sift sand. Hmm. Can you not sift sand? Why can you not sift sand? Uh, but, but, but maybe we can't, we're supposed to be able to sift sand. Oh, we need a, we either need a string mesh. Maybe we need a string mesh. All right. All right. I'll make a string mesh then. How much? How many do you need for a string mesh? I guess we'll find out. I think yeah. I think it's just nine, like this. I think that's eight. <laughs> Counting with orange. I cannot. Uh, I count. So, all right. There we go. String mesh. Did I make it? What happened? Oh, I think I like doubled it up or something, but uh, alright, yeah, so I need to put, the, kind of place some of these materials too, I'm gonna put this stuff in, in uh, here, and I'm gonna sift the sand, what, still can't sift it, oh, I didn't even put the mesh in, <laughs> yeah, I'm not thinking very straight, alright, so, time to start sieving, sifting, sieving, sifting, <laughs> I don't know how to say it, uh, s siftering, whatever, however you say it. Great. So we did not get black quartz or ancient spore. That's fine. I will do that later. I don't want to. I don't want to sieve anymore right now or sieve. <laughs> I really need to learn how to pronounce that word. All right. So uh, automation kit three. Where's automation kit one and two? These dusts really fly everywhere and fill up my inventory fast. It would work a lot better if they are connected with the vacuum hopper, which you can have, which can have its face assigned to output into nearby inventories. From there, you can connect it into further storage or processing lines. All right, uh, vacuum hopper and small storage crate. Okay, sounds good. Um, we not get it. I guess we didn't claim it. All right, I'm gonna put this here. Can this output upwards? We'll see. Oh, we probably can't. Oh, can you open crates with a block overhead on top? Uh, lag. Good shot. Can't push E to close vacuum upper. Seems like a good bug, bug, but yeah, we can't open that. So now, if we uh, were to sieve anything or sieve anything, it will go into that. And hopefully, you can tell me how to say sieve or sieve in the in the comments. If you're if you want to leave a comment, of course, an iron pickaxe, um, which is this is interesting. So, iron pickaxe is crafted with baguettes, and this is I think intentional. And I say that like I, I don't know though, but that is means we need wheat, which we need. So an iron pickaxe is not available for us. It's not in the cards right now because. We need to make baguettes. Why? Why would you make a pickaxe out of baguette? Uh, out of baguettes? I don't know. But don't ask me. But that's what we have to do. We need it. That is the recipe. We need to make baguettes. We need dough. We need 
wait for that. All right, so um, that is coming up in the future, I guess. Uh, better strain. Let's go ahead and make that. Uh, let's go smell down our iron chunk because it is a quest we have to use eventually, right? So um, we go smell it up, and um, then we'll be able to make our what's it called? Survivalist strainer dance. That's not. That's not bad. These are just, um, oh, that's, that's dense, that, that's, we have infinite string, as I said. Let me get the next one. All right, hello. Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right, so, uh, survivalist strainer, which we can make out of dense net, and uh, iron nuggets. Throw it in the, let's just put it in, I don't know if this is a difference in the stuff you can get, like this gets better, yeah, this gets different stuff. It gets sand, gravel, and dirt, and tiny coal. But do we want that? Nah. Oh, let's see if I can get our... We can make our fish now. We can make our fish. What is that? Oh, man! That's fantastic! That is amazing! Feather falling four? What? Not, I don't actually know how far we're going to be f having to feather fall in this pack, because... Because uh, obviously there's not much space, so I think if we fell off any place in here, we would not take any fall damage. All right, do we have any more food? We have this rice bread. Let's eat this rice bread. We're getting food though. We're about to make some food, and this will finish up our quest. Now that we got this fish, right? I think so. We can claim our reward. They make a solid survival trainer. A solid survival trainer. Dense. Let's look at what those do, and we got this done. All right. Alright, well, uh, I think I'm going to end this episode off here, so hopefully you enjoyed it. Let me know if you did enjoy it, and let me know if you want to keep, let me keep doing this. I'm probably going to keep playing it anyway, because I'm having fun. But uh, So thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a, a comment and tell me what you thought of the episode, and have a great day. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.